multiple encounters with Liam. Uh, multiple times had come down to the lobby, was causing a disturbance, kept being escorted back up to his room. Um, there was an incident where he was very frustrated and was smashing his laptop in the lobby. And then the final time he came back down, he actually passed out in the lobby of the hotel, um, started to look like convulsing a little bit and had to be physically like taken back up to his room. And that was about five minutes before um, the eventual incident. Tragedy struck the music world when Liam Payne, former member of One Direction, was found dead in Argentina following a shocking incident that left fans around the globe devastated. According to Argentine authorities, Liam fell from a third floor balcony and passed away instantly due to multiple injuries, including a fractured skull. Witnesses at the hotel revealed that before the tragic incident, Liam appeared to be acting erratically as if under the influence of something. In the hotel lobby, workers reportedly escorted him back to his room multiple times. A guest later confided to a friend that Liam had been taking substances and was even seen destroying the room. One of my um, friends it was in the room right across the hall from him and heard very loud screaming, um, a lot of just almost primal noises, grunting, screaming, coming from the hotel room. Heard an argument with his friend earlier in the day, um, but during the immediate fall, I didn't hear any noises. Uh, I've been diagnosed with a couple of conditions. Not to go into too much into detail, but one of them that I, I have, um, basically, there's a lot of manic things in my life which you guys saw. Another witness mentioned he was accompanied by two women at the time. Some reports claim Liam was trying to jump into the hotel pool, but tragically fell into an internal courtyard meant for employees. The police were called around 5 p.m. local time after receiving an emergency alert about an aggressive individual, possibly under the influence. Pablo Policicchio, communications director for the Buenos Aires Security Ministry, confirmed that Liam had jumped from his room's balcony. The entire world was shaken by the news, especially those who cherished him from his time with One Direction. In the hours before his passing, Liam had posted what would be his final video on Snapchat, showing him having breakfast with his partner, Kate Cassidy. Though it's believed Kate had returned to Florida days earlier, Morning, everybody. Here's a little video of me. It's a lovely day here in Argentina. Yeah, so it's going to be a nice day. And then you're going home. Ha ha, loser. Fans continue to share messages of grief and support online. Even celebrities have expressed their sorrow. Harry Styles' mother shared a touching post on Instagram with a broken heart emoji writing simply, just a boy. As fans and fellow stars continue to mourn, Liam Payne's legacy as an artist and his impact on millions will never be forgotten. His untimely passing has left an unfillable void in the hearts of his loved ones and his fans across the world. Rest in peace, Liam Payne. Gone, but never forgotten.